right, guys, I thought I'd share something tonight that I haven't seen a, a lot of other uh, FPV guys do. Um, most guys are connecting their uh, whatever multi rotor they might be working on. This is the Dave C. Rec in here, one of my favorites. But uh, when you're going to configure things in beta flight, most guys are hooking their drone up to their PC, taking a laptop out in the field or whatever. And uh, for quite a while, um, I've been just using my Android phone. Now, I don't know if this works for uh, iPhone or not, but you just use a, a USB uh, OTG cable, on-the-go cable, and uh, connect it to a regular uh, USB cable charging cable this happens to be a magnetic one um, to micro uh, USB so or micro yeah USB on the reckon so just plug this into the bottom of my Android set this back on this cradle yeah, looks like that'll still work and then connect it to the uh, micro USB-C of the flight controller. Beta flight will open. It's actually Speedy B on Android. That's what you, the app you'll look up is called Speedy B. But you'll see once you connect. Um, now, you, if you have a uh, Bluetooth or, I guess, Wi-Fi uh, flight controller, you have these options. I don't have one, so I'm just going to connect with uh, USB-C here. Hopefully, you guys can see that okay. And it's going to say connect. And there we go. There should be pretty well what you guys are used to seeing. Um, I don't think it's lacking anything. Um, you can go through all the different settings, um, your setup page, everything's there. Your ports, configuration, naming your quad all the different stuff there battery power and battery your uh, fail safe modes your pid tuning page here um, we're not connected to a controller but there's your control controller configuration or receiver sorry um, your different modes. I've been real spoiled by this. It's it's just so so easy. It shows all your satellites. Here is the motors and uh, it's ESC motor speed control, motor direction control. Um, there's your OSD page. Your black box. VTX. And there's a couple more. Mode and pin, so I don't even know what that is. And then there's the CLI right there. Where you can enter your commands. Um, yeah, I just thought I'd share that with you guys. It is so simple and easy to use um, on the Android phone. So hopefully that'll help somebody out. Um, you know, if you need to do any configurating out in the field, it's super easy being able to just take your cell phone with you. I was watching one of the 
YouTube celebs uh, showing off a new backpack tonight and showing the the uh, laptop pocket that it had and I just thought my goodness I can't imagine hauling a laptop out to the field when I can just uh, use my Android phone so anyways uh, thanks for watching and uh, this is up north FPV over and out